Hi guys, welcome to another edition of Cyber Reviews. The iPhone X and Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus were both released in 2017. These phones were two of the best phones released that year. They both have fantastic specs and performance. After two years of being on the market, the prices have drastically reduced and if you are looking to buy a new phone, especially during Black Friday weekend, then this video may help you to decide which is best for your needs. Now in this comparison video, we are going to look at the performance in terms of entertainment. Which device is best for media and entertainment? We are going to look at factors like the size of the display, audio quality, speed of playback if you are streaming content, the brightness of the screen, and more. And to help us put things in perspective, we are going to play the latest video of Sarkodia featuring Ifia on YouTube to help us make this comparison. Coming up next. The reason why we chose this particular video is because the visuals in this video are amazing. The colors and the cinematography are really well done in this video. It also has a very catchy beat and it is a great song overall. The title of the song is Sarah, which when translated into English means just as it is. And the concept behind the video is that of a couple who are madly in love and they have their imperfections and these imperfections have led to tensions in their relationship. However, they still love each other just as they are. To ensure that performance was not affected by other background apps, we start off by closing all open apps on both devices. Next, we head over to YouTube and then play the video at the same time. The Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus has a 6.2 inch display, whilst the iPhone X has a 5.8 inch display. The S9 Plus also has a higher resolution of 2960 by 1440, resulting in a 570 ppi pixel density. As compared to the iPhone X, which has a 2436 by 1125 resolution, resulting in a pixel density of 458 ppi. The Samsung display uses Super AMOLED technology, which makes it more vibrant and saturated than that of the OLED display of the iPhone X. So in the video, you can see that the sky in the Samsung video looks very blue and the rose looks very red. Some may like it, but I prefer the natural looking colors of the iPhone X. In terms of brightness, when you use these phones outside, the S9 Plus is the brighter of the two. However, indoors is a different story. Indoors, you cannot force the S9 Plus to produce its max brightness, so the iPhone X wins in indoor conditions. Now let's look at the audio quality. On the S9 Plus, the speakers are front-facing and tuned by 8kg. Plus, the speakers on the S9 Plus support Dolby Atmos for a surround sound effect. When listening to the two phones one at a time, I noticed that the iPhone X was louder but the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus had a clearer, richer quality. The S9 Plus also has earphones tuned by AKG and it comes with a headphone jack. So in terms of audio, the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus wins. Since this is a media and entertainment comparison, we need to talk about storage. Both phones come with a base model of 64 gigs of storage. However, the S9 Plus has expandable storage of up to 400 gig. This offers a much cheaper way to expand storage if you want to opt for the cheaper model with less built-in storage. Also, because of the flexibility that Android devices provide, you can easily copy your movies onto it and watch anywhere you go. If you are going to be streaming a lot of content on your device, you would definitely want your device to be able to have strong Wi-Fi connectivity. I have noticed over two years of using both phones that the Wi-Fi hardware on the Samsung S9 Plus is better than that of the iPhone X. In this comparison, I connected both devices to the same Wi-Fi, and you can see that the iPhone X has a harder time playing back content from YouTube. It keeps buffering and lagging. Sometimes the connection drops entirely. Once you are connected to Wi-Fi and are streaming content at max resolutions, you should be concerned about your battery performance. Here too, the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus takes the lead. 
The Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus has a 3500 mAh battery, whilst the iPhone X comes with 2760 mAh. However, the hardware and software optimization allows the iPhone to last pretty long too, though not as long as the S9 Plus. In addition, the S9 Plus comes with fast charging and a fast charging adapter included in the box. The iPhone X does not have a fast charging adapter included in the box. There are things you can do to get it to charge quickly however, so subscribe to the channel if you've not yet done so because I will be bringing you iPhone tips and tricks soon. Both phones are capable of wireless charging, but the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus has the benefits of fast wireless charging included. So though it looks like the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus wins clearly when it comes to entertainment, there is more to the phone than entertainment. So let me know which you prefer and why. Click here to watch my review of the Samsung Galaxy S8 and click here if you want to learn more about wireless charging. Thanks, Bebre.